801. Show number 43. A celebration of Easter. I'm a non-believer, so that's not going to amount to much. I do believe in one thing. I believe, well, two things. I believe in Matt and Amy Hendrickson. They're at home right now. They're in love. I get high whenever I see you. I get high whenever I need to. I don't need to tell you what's going on. You're not shy, you know what I'm saying. You don't sit at home crocheting. You're the inspiration behind this song. So come on, baby. Get me drunk and take me where you take me. I don't want to know. Come on, baby. Get me drunk and take me anywhere you want to go. have an excellent body you don't have an excellent body what we've got is perfectly fine with me we don't have a hollywood romance we don't have big muscles and implants everyone's so beautiful on tv so come on baby get me drunk and take me where you take me i don't want to know come on baby get me drunk and take me anywhere you want to go Drunk and take me where you take me. I don't want to know. Come on, baby. Get me drunk and take me anywhere you want to go. Now, everyone's cutting, lacking, and buffing, quaffed and gelled, and all of that stuff, but they're all dancing around one another. You and I are not like the rest, all self absorbed, all self obsessed. You and I are into each other. Into each other. Yeah, you and I are into each other. Okay, I'm gonna sing it like Matt sings it. Come on, Amy, get me drunk and take me where you take me. I don't wanna know. Come on, Amy, get me drunk and take me anywhere you wanna go. Say yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. One more time, I say yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to my show. So many birthdays, so many anniversaries. We have an anniversary. Carolyn Rosewall, Marshall Roth have been married for five years. I wrote a little song for them. Carolyn Rosewall and Marshall Roth. One's a preppy and one's a goth. Both of them like this song. Well, I don't know much, but I can see that I love you. You love me. We didn't plan this out. It was luck, and we don't make love. We just circle around the bed wearing wicked smiles with our clothes in every corner of the room. I hope that we can be together soon. Well, our heart 
heart speed fast, the music slow. I got my high by high and the lights down low. You say, come here, daddy, and kiss me quick. I touch your hand and you touch my heart like no one else has ever touched before. And soon you're wearing nothing but perfume. I hope that we can be together soon. Be together soon. Be together soon. Be together soon. Because when you're not here, I feel lost. I got my doors wide open and my fingers I said when you're not here, I can't wait. I take a long hot bath and I master French and Italian and a little bit of Greek. I write a lovely poem about the moon. I hope that we can be together soon. 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 We'll be together soon. We'll be together soon. We'll be together soon. Happy anniversary, Carolyn and Marshall. Of course, of course, Rod out in the Colorado. Rod. He always requests something, well, something from the Yipes catalog. Treat me like a big man Cause I don't want to feel so insecure Sometimes I know just why you're laughing at me But then again, I'm never sure I got a rotten reputation But I remember what my mama used to say She said I'd get the things I wanted to have If I would ask a certain way Please Love me tonight, please make it be right, and please say please tonight. I'm asking you in desperation, there's nothing that I want as much as you, when my desires get the better of me, there's not a lot that I can do. Please love me tonight. Please make it be right. And please say please tonight. How does it feel? It feels alright. I put it in words, but I'm not very bright. You tomorrow if you love me tonight. Hey, please love me tonight. Please make it be right. And please say please. First time I ever played that song on guitar. First time. And now, let us venture. Let us venture. What's that, Mr. Gates? What? What? I'm completely vaccinated, ladies and gentlemen. But lately, I've been hearing voices. Some Mr. Gates. What do you want me to do, Mr. Gates? Leave Whitefish Bay and start having orgies with 17-year-old girls? Oh my God! It's not Bill Gates talking to me. It's Matt Gates, Congressman. 
Man, that vaccination, dangerous. You know it's not really a vaccine. That was my impression of Kimmy's waxer. All right, Mark Kunkel, you've been requesting this song for weeks, but I'm not doing this song for you tonight. I'm doing this song for a birthday boy, Tim Hornberger. Tim Hornberger, you have wonderful children. Well, three of them. This is from Sophie, your daughter, and her sisters, but not your son because he's too damn cheap. I hope you like this song, Tim. Around the corner from the Hotel Belmont In a coffee shop full of broken faces Keep my eyes and my ears wide open Hearing all the romantic places What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? Will I? Drifting on and am caught up in the crosstown traffic. Drifting on an empty ocean. Everybody walks on pins and needles. They don't want to cause no big commotion. What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know? Will I die in pursuit? What will I do when I find it? Will I start it out all filled with passion? I left my home to September. I used to have the strongest feeling, most of which I can't remember. What will I do when I find her? What will I do when I find her? What will I do when I find her? Will I? What will I do when I find you? What will I do when I find you? What will I do when I find you? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know? Will I die in pursuit? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know the reason why I'm in pursuit? Will I rise? Will I fall? Will it make no sense at all in pursuit? I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. Okay, Mark Kunkel, Mark and Peggy are on the same page this week. I don't know what you're doing. Maybe you took an edible before the show. Thank you, by the way, Joe Hip. You like to reminisce about the night that we first met when I said hello. And lit the wrong end of my cigarette You tell me it was magical and mystical Later on, quite physical The first tiny step on the road of our lives together A night that we'll share in our hearts and our minds together Or was it August or September? I was high so I don't remember
to reminisce about the night that we were wed. When we cut the cake and then we ran off to our nuptial bed. You tell me it was beautiful, mysterious, both of us delirious. The next giant step on the road of our lives together. A night that we'll share in our hearts and our minds forever. Or was it August or September? I was high, so I know. Excuse me, Mark. Yeah, you too, Peggy. I think I'm about to freak out. Best freak out ever. Thanks again, Joe Hip. like to reminisce about when you were just a kid and you regale me with the wild and dangerous things you did like how you used to cheer the team and go on dates now and then stay out too late you were wholesome and trustworthy back then when nobody trusted me your boyfriend was in a tuxedo and I was in custody did I meet you that September? Oh, my living room sounds better than ever. Here we go, everyone. Welcome to show 43, number 43, in a series of uh, more than that. What's that, Mr. Gates? Mr. Never wear a mask, wear a gas mask to the grocery store? Oh, oh, like you did in the Congress. Okay, Mr. Gates, oh, oh, okay, introduce the staff. Oh, see, I'm being told, I'm being, I, I know that Suez tanker was filled with children on their way to Hillary Clinton, wasn't it? Hey, let's find out who's running sound tonight. Well, same guy who's running sound for 42 shows in a row, Mr. Pipe Jim. James Schaffelberger. Fully vaccinated. On camera, the ever handsome Kevin Hansen. Non vaccinated, am I right? Next, next week. Next week, you're going to be talking to Matt Gates, and it's going to be amazing. <laughs> Brian Murphy, Brian Murphy, who was so amazing, they only had to give him half a shot. Brian Murphy on whatever he does here. <laughs> Brian Murphy for bringing us fish dinner tonight. Fish fry! And last but not least, keeping the glasses full for 42 shows, and now on 43, the goddess of Grigio. The mistress of alcohol, Bethany McCurdy. Let's go. Uh, oh yeah. The mistress of alcohol, the drinking word tonight it will be, of course, I don't even have one yet. Base, it could be baseball, gates, egg, Easter. It could be, see, I do anything about Jesus, I get a lot of trouble. No matter how, who's listening, how many hyphenated names are listening out there, I still get shit for the Jesus stuff. Uh, the drinking word today will be, oh, fish. Here's to fish. And I any way you spell it, okay? So if I'm going to go listen to some dad, maybe I'll listen to some fish. Here we go. There we go. Oh, happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday to Kathy Fisher. 
And by the way, this is a perfect cocktail I'm drinking right now. Mm. Thank you, Mistress of Alcohol. Okay, Kevin. Kevin, the ever handsome. Started this song last week when we were sitting in that little room over there with my guitars. It's really a hard song to play. Ladies and gentlemen, the new song for this week is called Everyone Got Rich. Let's see if we can do this. Intro was hard. Started out bright eyed and bushy tail. Work hard, son, and you will never fail. What a big lie that turned out to be. Everyone got rich except for me. that I was doing pretty well Looked around and I can tell I'm living on the cusp of poverty Cause everyone got rich except for me got rich like they expected to everyone got rich but I got you <laughs> for that I'm thankful every single day you and I were getting by okay we're not really ones to make a but everyone got rich except for us. Money can buy lots of pretty things. And think of the advantages it brings. Growing up in a wealthy family That's how everyone gets rich Except for me Everyone got rich All my best friends too Everyone got rich But I got you Everyone got rich. I guess their blood turned blue. Everyone got rich, but I got you. I have a belated birthday wish for Kelly Wade Milton. This comes from Sergey and Natasha from Madison. Actually, Sergey and Natasha are really named Dan and Kimberly. And happy belated birthday, Kelly! All little girls want a dreamboat boy, rich, young, pretty, and tan. All little boys want a sweet little thing, rich, young, pretty, and tan. Don't you know it's a proven fact? We all want sex in a Cadillac. Once in front and twice in back. We want it to be like on TV. Rich, young, pretty, and tan. I'm going to pretend I'm doing a live show right now. Raise your hands if you're rich. Raise your hands if you're young. Raise your hands if you're pretty. Raise your hands if you're poor, old, ugly, and in the way. Raise your hands if there are a lot of songs in this show that you forgot you even wrote. 
What's that, Matt? <laughs> Play them anyway. Dedicate them all to Ron DeSantis. Everybody help me. All my friends can't wait to be. Personally, I would hate to be. Spend a fortune on your clothes. You dress up right so that no one knows about that itch that comes and goes. What is he that wants to be? Rich, young, broody, and tan. Say the rich, young, pretty tan. Come on, rich. Rich, young, pretty tan. Oh, man. Once again, look in the dish dictionary. No, Google, Google on fire. First thing that comes up, Pat McCurdy. <laughs> East and west and north and south. Rich, young, broody, and tan. With pouting lips and open mouth. Rich, young, broody, and tan. Life's rewards can be so sweet. Unless you get too indiscreet with the slugs you pick up off the street. Can't it be like on TV? Rich, young, broody, and tan. And why can't it be like on TV? Rich, young, broody, and tan. And why can't it be like on TV? Rich, young, broody, and tan. Oh. Nice. And rich, young, pretty tan. Come on, rich. Rich, young, pretty, and tan. Oh, man. Yeah. Kelly Wade Milton. Rich, young, pretty, and tan. Rich, young, pretty, and tan. Rich, young, pretty, and tan. Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. And rich, young, pretty, tan. Do you notice the, the link between the last two songs? Everyone got rich, young, pretty, and tan. That would be called an overlap on Jeopardy. Ah, I'm back into Jeopardy. Winter Soldier, I like that too. What else do, oh, I watched Godzilla vs. Kong this week. Oh, 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 thumbs, thumbs up. And I watched the four-hour Snyder Cut of Justice League of America. I'm giving that a big thumbs up, ladies and gentlemen. Watch it over three nights, you're good. Right now, I'm saying happy birthday, one of the greatest people with the most lovely hair. It's Laura. She lives in Madison, Laura Tucker. And she said she claimed that her morals are deplorable. And that's why I guess she requested this song that I haven't played for a long time. A lot of lyrics, Laura. It goes, you only like me when you're drinking. You only like me when there's nobody else around. You call me up in the middle of the night. You only like me when you're drinking. You only like me after you've looked all over town. You call me up in the middle of the night. Call me up in the middle of the night. Call me up, call me up in the middle of the night. Your big blue eyes are adorable. Your morals are deplorable. Your kiss is irresistible. Your myth is almost mystical. But you only like me when you're drinking. You only like me in the wee hours of Sunday morning. 
I get a text in the middle of the night. You only like me when you're drinking. You only like me when you're drunk and you feel forlorn. I get a text in the middle of the night. I get a text in the middle of the night. I get a text in the in the middle of the night. Those big blue eyes are adorable. Your morals are deplorable. Your lips are much too kissable. Your hips are too. me when you're drinking you only like me after you'd had a beer or two my phone is buzzing in the middle of the night you only like me when you're drinking you only like me because you know i'll be there for you my phone is buzzing in the middle of the night my phone is buzzing in the middle of the night my phone is buzzing in the middle of the night Your big blue eyes are adorable Your morals are deplorable Your charm is undeniable Your weekly calls reliable much too much too beautiful one fact is indisputable you only like me when you're drinking oh, i practiced that one a long time Bo, the wonder dog. Yeah. Bo, the master of tennis balls. Bo could never be a tennis player because he'd have his racket in one hand, the ball in the other hand. He'd take that ball, he'd look at it a few times. And that was my impression of Bo, spitting his ball on my chest when I'm trying to sleep in the morning. I am doing so many impressions tonight. You want to hear Kimmy's waxer again? <laughs> no, what I want to do is a love song. Well, no, this is not a love song at all. I don't even know what I'm talking about. I must have eaten too much fish fry. I love it when Murph brings dinner. Mm. <laughs> Give him a plug. From the Bay, Whitefish Bay's finest restaurant. A absolutely the finest fish fry in the North Shore. North Shore? Can't get there from here. <laughs> sound like, sound like a, we were in Maine or something like that. We're not in Maine, we're in Wisconsin. What's that, Mr. Gates? Oh, this is Bill Gates now? Oh my God, these back scenes are full of everything. This is a song that sounds like it should be true. For David Vaca, who is on the list to be on Jeopardy. Aaron Rodgers next week. What person requesting song? Oh, requested antiques at Pat's show. You got it, Joe Hip! David Vaca for 600. She said, sit down and don't touch anything. I did what I was told. And later that night, we lay down on a bed that was almost 200 years old. But she lived house that was filled with antiques made by Egyptians, Italians, and Greeks. She said she would call in a couple of weeks, but she never did. 
she said, lie down and don't say a word. I was quiet as can be. And all the dead ancestors up on a wall, they swore down their noses at me. Cause she lived in a house that was filled with antiques, made by Egyptians, Italians, and Greeks. She said she would call in a couple of weeks, but she never did. said don't get too comfortable I'm used to sleeping alone when she put on a robe once worn by a queen I knew it was time to go home when she said we must do this again sometime I know she was just being nice something so scary and wonderful how it only happens twice she lived in a house that was filled with antiques Made by Egyptians, Italians, and Greeks She said she would call in a couple of weeks But she never did She lived in a house that was filled with antiques Made by Egyptians, Italians, and Greeks She said she would call in a couple of weeks But she never did It is Karen Banks' birthday. B E N C S. Not B A N K S, pronounced like a European. Karen, Karen Banks. Mike Beeman, it's your birthday. For some reason, Karen and Mike, someone requested that I sing, well, probably the sexiest love song I ever wrote. I've been swimming in a pool of goldfish. Pretending they're piranha Sleeping with a girl named Katie Pretending her name's a racer Would you like to know what I'm doing In my shack out in the woods I can't tell ya But it's something feels so good I'm choking the gopher I'm slamming the hand in the rocket, flogging the dolphin, oh yes I am, I'm choking the gopher, I'm chalking the cue, I'm spanking the monkey, and I'm thinking about you. Use. I've been working in a coal mine. Pretending I'm digging up diamonds Hanging around bars and nightclubs Pretending I'm social climbing Would you like to know what I'm doing To the wee hours of the night I can't tell ya But it's something feels so right Choking the gopher I'm slamming the hand I'm taming the lion, slaying the dragon, oh yes I am. I'm choking the gopher, I'm chalking the cue, I'm spanking the monkey, and I'm thinking about you. Oh, it's been weeks since she's done this. The ladies and germs. The ever beautiful Kimmy! I'm juicing the mango. I'm flipping the switch. 
I'm orbiting Venus, and I don't need a penis to be one sex to fish. I'm gilding the lily, I'm taming the shrew, I'm saucing the taco, and I'm not thinking about you. How many times Sorry, have you done Jeff. this on at virtual shows? Six, seven, eight, nine? How many times have we played 69. this? Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine. <laughs> 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 you just never get it right. And now's your time to, to make it up. Do it, do it right this time. Here we go. I'm buffing the muffin. Oh, what a muffin. I'm patting the cat. I'm driving Miss Daisy, and I'm thinking about Pat. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, the ever beautiful Kimmy at the airport. Oh, I got a new one tonight. I got a new one. In France, of course, they say, I'm grinding my chocolate. I'm leering my remini. I'm Jack climbing his own feet star, and I'm thinking about Kimmy. Oh. Oh, wait. I'm smacking the cracker. I'm attacking Peru. I'm choking the gopher, and I'm thinking about Karen Banks too. I'm choking the gopher, and I'm thinking about y'all. Choking the gopher, and I'm thinking about you. I'm choking the gopher, I'm angling the fish. I'm choking the gopher, and I'm thinking about you. Yeah. Once more for Kimmy. Come on. Let's... Oh, my God. And now, now, a word from the sponsors of this show. A word for the people who make this show possible for the last bunch of weeks. What's next week? Today is the 2nd. We will be doing a show on the 9th, the 16th, the 23rd, and the 30th. And then we're going to do some live shows starting in May. Oh, I, I forgot how to do it. I don't think I'll be able to do it. But I'll try my best, ladies and gentlemen. And if they suck, it's not my fault. It's the pandemic and Matt Gates's fault. Because he's talking to me all the time. I can't get his, yeah. But let's thank Mark and Julie Degner for, for donating to this show. When you donate to this show, a good piece of that donation goes to my son's college education and weed fund. <laughs> The Sullivans of Alabama are 42 for 42, and if they're watching tonight, you know what they are, perfect. Chad Alshouse, or as we call him, Cheddar. We, f we finished your bottle, Cheddar. Dave and Laura Marin, uh, thank you. Andrew Ryan, hello, Andrew. Andrew Ryan, one of my favorite names, two first names for a name. John Acerbi from Portland, Oregon. Steve Hanks, no relation to Tom, I hope. Steve Hanks, M do you think? I don't know. We from that day on, if I was going somewhere, I was running. Steve. Jared Finger, one of our favorites. Jared Finger. Work there, Jared. How many times did you see that when you were a kid? Monica Hall. Abby Labe. All names that we say every week. If you're watching the show and you haven't donated, what the hell? You don't have to. I don't care that much. But, you know, it makes me feel loved. Uh, Melvin Slate. Dan and Lisa Elias. Of course. They're my neighbors, and they don't even have to. I, I see them. I, I walk the dog, and there's their dog. Oh, what's their dog's name again? Bailey. Oh, Bailey. Yeah, she's a little nutty. <laughs> Bailey, famous Baileys, Irish cream, and the receptionist on KRP in Cincinnati. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Uh, Kevin Slavish. Kevin Slavish, Derek Mosher. What? What the hell was she? I forget. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, Lonnie Anderson. Was the receptionist. <laughs> Bailey Quarters was maybe the intern or something like that. <laughs> or was she on Cotter? I don't know. 
What do you say, Matt? Can you tell me what she was on? Oh, you're only 38 years old. Only 20 years older than your preferred mate. Uh, Lee Jacobs. Thank you, Lee. Paul Greasy. Uh, or Gre Grease. Stevens Patrick. I can't wait to say your name every week. Tim and Susan Griffin are in uh, Asheville, North Carolina. If you've never been to Asheville, you should go to see Tim and Susan. That town is crazy. Chris and Tisha Hyden from the Lacrosse area. I hope they're not drinking bottled water. Maybe. No, no, there's some sort of island in. What's the island? Yeah, they can't drink the water. Clifford Christofferson. Is that is that alliteration? Thank you, Clifford. He's big. He's a big red dog. Joseph Lyman, Massachusetts. Amy Brenmoen. Moen. Brenmoen. Brian Clary. Stephen Peggy Brenner in Oconomowoc. What happened to Carly? Is she still out there? Hey, oh, everybody ready to say happy birthday to Michelle Croak? Michelle Croak! From Kathy Croak, Jasmine Pellegrino. I know who you are, Jasmine. Uh, is your how's your father? How's your father? Is he still still owning that that blues club down there in Chicago? Frank, Jasmine. Thank uh, happy birthday, Jasmine. It's great to hear from you, Elliot Hill. Elliot. Uh, Juliana Gifford in Massachusetts. Juliana, you add an A to my son, and you have you. Maybe you don't think that's amazing. I do. George Wood. Is that my George Wood? What the hell? He's not watching this crap, is he? Hey, George Wood, happy birthday. And last but not la least, laced. Last but not least, Scott Stubes Stuber. Stubes. Happy birthday. I got your name right. I, s I say something different every time. Oh, but you know what? I'd like to do a song right now. Now that I've thanked some people, I'd like to thank Ann Shower Jimenez out there in Arizona. Ann requested that I play this song, but also feature Bobo, the Wonder Dog. Hey, Bo. Hey, Bo, come up and say hi to Ann Shower Jimenez. Heel. I, I don't know, Ann. Can you see him? He's a beauty, isn't he? All right, Ann. When I go shopping for groceries, don't want anyone getting close to me. I don't want anybody's germs, not hers or his. Lately, I don't even know what day it is. Do all my living in the living room. I talk to people on Zoom while watching Parks and Recreation season four. I hardly know what day it is anymore. It might be Tuesday. I don't know. You're in quarantine, time passes slowly, it might be Friday, it don't matter a bit, there's a bug out there and I'm not catching it, there's a bug out there and I'm not catching it, every day seems like Sunday afternoon to me, every night. Was dragging on and on endlessly. My lifestyle changes have been stunning. I've worn the same clothes for days running. You come over, maybe I'll Purell you. But if you ask what day it is, I can't tell ya. Might be Tuesday. I don't know when you're in quarantine. Time passes slowly. It might be Friday, but don't matter a bit. There's a 
bug out there and I'm not catching it. It might be Tuesday. I don't know. You're in quarantine. Time passes slowly. It might be Friday. It don't matter a bit. <laughs> There's a bug out there and I'm not catching it. There's a bug out there and I'm not catching it. There's a bug out there and I'm not catching it. It might be Tuesday. I don't know. And now a song that I completely forgot that I wrote. But Todd Harrod didn't forget. I don't know where you came up with this one, Todd. What? I wasted all my money. I squandered my last wish. I wanted milk and honey. All I got was beer and fish. But I'm disconnected. Disconnected from myself. I'm not here. I'm someplace else. Whenever I'm in trouble, whenever I feel fear, I get out on the double, though it seems like I'm still here. I'm disconnected, disconnected from myself. I'm not here, I'm someplace else. I'm disconnected from myself. I'm not here, I'm someplace else. I live in a mansion, I live in a ditch. You love me cause I'm handsome, I like you cause you're rich. But I'm disconnected, disconnected from myself. I'm not here, someplace else. We sit around your table, we're drinking quite a lot. And then your daddy says those goddamn liberals should be shot off. Oh, I'm disconnected, disconnected from myself. Someplace else, I'm disconnected yeah, from myself. I'm not here. I'm someplace else. I guess I'll grin and bear it. I guess I'll do my best. Playing for Todd Harris and this obscure request. I'm disconnected, disconnected from myself. I'm not here, I'm someplace else. I'm lying on my deathbed, as stiff as I can be. There's someone up in heaven, but Lord, it isn't me. I'm disconnected, disconnected from myself. Someplace else, I'm disconnected from myself. I'm not here. I'm someplace else, disconnected yeah, from myself. I'm not here. I'm someplace else. You know, when I used to do challenges, I always always play a real easy song after. Me. Like this one requested by Sheila Finnamore of D Durham, Maine. Sheila, one year now. I'm not gonna even go into why I'm playing this song for you, Sheila. But you are a strong woman. Listen. I'm a patient man, you know I am, but you're pushing me to the limit. Imagine a picture of me and you would. You've been on my back for a trillion years, I can't take another minute. Imagine a picture of me and you would. Imagine a picture of me in a Cadillac, 
speeding out of town. Imagine a picture of our happy home burning to the ground. It's an endless fight. Wrong, you're right. Ain't no way I can win it. Imagine a picture of me and you. Sing it! Oh, you know what? Let me tell you a story. Let me explain. There's a special woman who lives in Durham, Maine. And she thrills me to my very core. Everybody, let's have a round of inspiration for Sheila Finnamore. Me and Sheila would love to get it on. I better spend a few months on the Peloton. I just, want to, I just want to say one thing. And I think the mistress of alcohol will agree with me on this. Those Peloton ads drive me completely crazy. No one is going to tell me to pedal faster. No one! And those magic exercise mirrors. No one is going to put a magic exercise mirror in my house. I've already got Bill Gates and Matt Gates in my head. I'm fully vaccinated and ready to go play in northern Wisconsin where the women are beautiful and the men look like capital rioters. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm just making that up. I'm just kidding. Where the women love to drink and the men love to fish. <laughs> All right, Murphy, Ryan Murphy. Oh, you don't have your phone. Can you pick some random person watching this right now and I'll, sing a, I'll write a song for him? Mickey Poe is watching this. One place I love, I love to go, is a place in Wisconsin that you all know. It's a town that I love so. It's just called Madison. The home of Nikki Poe. Tisha on French Island. Okay. Don't want to get philosophical. Philosophical. Don't want to get philosophical. Don't want to get too polemical. Of the water in French Island filled with dangerous chemicals. Get on that pony. I'll start riding. Delivering bottled water to Tisha Hyder. Okay, why don't you all why don't you all phone a friend and say who's on fire? Because imagine a picture of me in a Cadillac speeding out of town. Imagine a picture of our happy home burning to the ground. It's an endless fight. Wrong, you're right. No way I can win it. Imagine a picture of me and you. Sing it! Imagine a picture of me and you. What? What's that? The vaccination is the mark of the bee. Oh, shit. Now I got Marjorie Taylor Greene talking to me in my left ear. Dang it. Whoa. Speaking of Marjorie Taylor Greene, <laughs> I'm going to do a song for Tammy Cordell right now. You 
say you won't give in to temptation just to get ahead. And you say you won't apologize for the nasty things you've said. You say you'll never compromise your principles anymore. Let me tell you something. Everyone's a whore. Everybody does things they don't want to do. Why should life be different for you? <laughs> I'm not insinuating that anyone's a whore. I'm insinuating that everyone's a whore. Say you won't ever compromise your principles anymore. You tell me. Let me tell you something. Sing it. Except Kimmy. Kimmy's not on. Oh, if I have something to say about that. <laughs> My second impression of Kimmy's waxer. It's the best show ever. <laughs> Everyone goes off to work to bring home some pay. Everybody ends up selling themselves in a million different little ways. Everybody does what they've got to do, but you don't know the score. Let me educate you. Everyone's a whore. Everybody does things they don't want to do. Why should life be different for you? Everybody does what they've got to do, but you don't know the score. Educate you. Or else they're just a liar. We've all been used before. We've all been sick and tired. But you say you'll never compromise your principles anymore. Let me tell you something. Let me educate you. I just remind you, accepting Tammy Cordell. Everyone's a whore. And now, to celebrate the new surge. I'd like to do a Facebook slow dance. Oh my God, look who just came down. Let's get him up here to say hello. It's Miles McCurdy, ladies and gentlemen. The master of Mortal Kombat. No, the master of Call of Duty. Kathy, you're just home? You missed the whole first part of the show? What the hell? Ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kathy, my mother-in-law. Fisher. Happy birthday to you. Thank you for coming down. Oh, uh, yeah, he's, he's been doing that all night. See you, Miles. Miles' hoodie is a, per, is a unique design, designed by Miles McCurdy, paid for by Pat McCurdy, unbeknownst. But are we doing our Facebook Live slow dance right now? song I performed at Brian Murphy's wedding. I think that was back in 1962. 700 guests. Now that would have been a super spreader event if it took place last summer. But I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close my eyes a little bit and think about Murph. No, I'm not. I'm not going to think about Murph. I'm just going to
to sing for Jeff and Sarah Briganti out there in, I think it's Colorado. Tomorrow, when I wake up, if indeed I ever wake up again, promise me you'll be there. Promise me you'll be there and not someplace else. Promise me you'll be there. And if I hurt you, I don't mean it. It's not me. It's just some scared old man. Promise me you won't cry. Promise me you won't cry. Don't let the tears fall down. Promise me you won't cry. And promise me you'll love me still when no one else around here will. Promise me you won't forget me. I can change things. Somewhat happy. Hope you smile when you think about me. Promise me you won't lie. Promise me you won't lie. Just tell me how you feel. Promise me you won't lie. Promise me. That you will stay when everybody else just drifts away. Promise me you won't forget me. I can change things if you let me. And tomorrow, when I wake up, if indeed I ever wake up again. Promise me you'll be there. Promise me you'll be there and not someplace else. Promise me you'll be God, I wrote this one until Mark Lippert reminded me. This used to be very, very popular. People used to sing the shit out of this song. I'm going to lose my mind and give away my brain so I won't have to think. I won't need to explain everything I do, everything I say. People will just smile in that condescending way As if they understand with pity in their eyes But if they really knew me, they would probably be surprised I'm gonna lose my mind, give away my brain Be without the stress and do without the strain I'll never have to work, I'll never have to pray I'll never have to bathe myself every other day I'll just sit by the pool with a glass of iced tea and sing la 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 I can live without my heart. I can live without my brain. I could live in institutions and be criminally insane. 
I'd never make a choice, never be afraid. I'd never raise my voice, and I never would get laid. As if that happens now, well, maybe once a year. And that's another problem that I hope will disappear. Cause I could live without my heart, live without my brain, live without pleasure, and live without pain. I could solve all my problems in one fell swoop. A nurse will hold my head to make sure it doesn't droop. I'll just put on my robe and I'll stare at the stars and sing la 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 A little song called Brainless, which leads right into... Well, last night I woke from a deep, deep sleep. I awoke and remembered my dreams. Oh, that's not something that I usually do. Or oh, you could shoot me and I'd sleep right through. But lately I've been so confused. And maybe you can tell me why. why in my dreams I was falling down a hole. Speeding through a tunnel, spelunking in a cave. Oh, what did it mean? I was flowing down the drain, hurtling down a mine shaft, stuck in quicksand. You were in my dreams. You were in, you were in my dreams. It's the Freudian love song. It's all about dreams and what they mean. And I'm playing this for, I'm playing this for Julia Bosman. Very late request in the day, but I stuck it in the set anyway, Julia. I just want to say that I had two odd dreams last night. Well, I have lots of dreams where my dog Bo can talk. And the things that dog says. I know we just met and we're hardly even friends, but I can't get you out of my mind. I probably shouldn't be telling you this. After all, we never even kissed. Tell me something I might have missed. And maybe you can tell me why. In my dreams, I was watering the lawn, shooting Roman candles, watching Old Faithful. Oh, what did it mean? I was putting out a fire, filling up the gas tank, mailing a letter. And you were in my dreams. You were in, you were in my dream. And do you dream about telephone poles, carrots and zucchini, riding a wild stallion, or making love with me? I'm the Washington Monument. And last night I woke from a deep, deep sleep. I dreamed that I was falling down a hole. Speeding through a tunnel, spelunking in a cave. Oh, what did it mean? I was flowing down the drain. Help me find my keys. We'll drive on out of here. You were in my dream. I was watering the lawn, shooting Roman candles, watching Old Faithful. Oh, what did it mean? I was driving a Corvette, churning butter, launching a Tomahawk cruise missile. Oiling the tin mat, playing Yahtzee, sliding down a fire pole, shucking oysters, jamming hot dogs through bagels, eating a chalupa, threading a needle, looking at an exhibition of Georgia O'Keeffe painting. I was fly fishing, and you were in my dream. You were in, you were in my dream.
Uh, thank you, Julia Bosman. You know who I haven't mentioned yet in this show? Mr. Paul Jones of Massachusetts. But mostly, I like Paul a lot. He's a great guy, but Shane, man. Shane, you're going to be a great, once you grow up, you're learning so many in, in, colorful words in this show. But Paul requested another song that I completely forgot I wrote. If I can get through this one, I'm going to applaud for myself. Paul Jones. You said you didn't want to see my ugly face around here anymore. You said a lot of nasty things, but nothing that I hadn't heard before. So I thought it was over, I thought it was done I thought I was destined to be the lonely one Now there's someone at my door Oh, I wonder who There's someone at my door Could it be you? If I should let you in after the shit you put me through I'm wondering if all the painful memories will come back if I do I know that they will cause they've never been gone I guess I'm just destined to be the lonely one Now there's someone at my door Oh, I wonder who my door. Could it be you? Could it be you? Break it down! I remember Christmas 1997 when you said we'd celebrate the holidays. I even bought a present for your mother called me up and said you'd move to Colorado to be near your college roommate cause you thought you might be gay and then you left her for a bartender named Johnny in Chicago and the only time I heard from you is when you needed money now you're back Back at the scene of the crime, you're back. So what do you want this time? Just when I thought it was over, I thought it was done. I thought I was destined to be the lonely one. There's someone at my door. Oh, I wonder who. There's someone at my door. It's you. Yes, it's you. Made it. Mayday, mayday. We have some more people to say thank you to, and that those people include Elizabeth Gallinger. Elizabeth Gallinger of the, of the Gallingers. Tony and Angela Van Ginkle, I think they come from Arizona, I'm not sure. Dave Hallbrooks comes from Milwaukee, hello David. Sean and Danny Closey, I think you come from Madison. I am making so many friends that I've never seen before in my life. And when I do see you at shows this summer, I'm gonna expect uh, vaccinated hugs, because I can do it. Polly Sailor, Polly Sealer. Pa Polly Sealer, not Audrey Sealer. Uh, Josh and Jenny from Kenosha. Joe Bryan and Amy, they come from Menominee Falls. Sarah Lezinski, Sarah Lezinski. Sarah has, let me count, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight consonants in her name, including two Zs. Man, if there were two Zs in Scrabble, you would be a word that I would do. Oh, proper noun, though, sorry. Bruce and Sylvia Haroldson, you are vaccinated. 
Karen Reiner and Paul Hansen too. Karen and Paul. Paul and Karen, Paul and Karen. Michelle Beckerest. I've said that name before and I mess it up every time. Marisa Rogers in Seattle would like me to work on We're Social Distancing with Mom and Dad. A song from the, like, the first show that I did. Uh, unfortunately, that would be more likely to go, We Stop Social Distancing with Mom and Dad. We Stop Social Distancing with Mom and Dad. Now the cases are spiking in Michigan and it's spreading. And here in Wisconsin, hell, Wisconsin, we have so much to be proud of. Uh, the, one of the highest COVID caseloads and Senator Ron Johnson, who I talk to on the phone almost every week. Pam and Corey from uh, Corey Melkars. <laughs> Kelly Kuss. Kelly Kuss from Raleigh, North Carolina. Raleigh, my dear. Mike and Jenny Conlon, thank you. Mauricio. Mauricio, you requested a song, and now I can't figure out if the song you requested is an old one that I wrote with the same title as one of my new ones. Is, is the song you requested go, I thought I could breathe, a sigh of relief, look what you've done to my heart. Is that the one you requested? Because I'll play that for you next week if you want. Dale, is that the one you wanted? Oh, Dale Emmons. I ain't too smart, but I have my moments. When I'm Dale fucking Emmons. Bruce Shower, I did one for your daughter. Now I could do Out in California. I got a rule. One Yipe song per show now, okay? Joe. Joe Hip. Out there in Oak Creek. I don't want to go to heaven because you won't be there. My sister Julia Gimbel. Now that you're gone. All that's left is a band of gold. All that's left of the dreams I hold is a band of gold. And the memory of what love could be if you are still here with me. That is an amazing song, ladies and gentlemen. It's copyrighted, so I sh probably shouldn't even have played that much of it. Michael Falk, thank you very much. Billy Berger, thank you very much. No request this week, Billy. Jan and Doug Thompson of San Diego, Eric Brock of San Francisco wanted me to play Television Ruin My, Television Ruin My, Television Ruin My Life, which is obvious. Uh, Mary, Margie, Molly, Cameron, CJ, and George Christensen watching tonight in Sarasota, Florida. Sarasota, Florida. Thank you. Should we show the new item of merchandise we're releasing this week? Oh, by the way, my new single... Let the small things get you down. They're giving us some grief uh, in, uh, in streaming land. We'll get that up as soon as we can. Available Sunday, let's have a nude party t-shirts. Can they see it? White letters on black t-shirts, all women's sizes, all men's sizes. Available Sunday, go to my website and go to the PAP merch area and get yourself. This is summer wear, ladies and gentlemen. This is strictly for summer. Let's have a nude party t-shirts. Your shot, and then we'll go shot. And then we can all go fishing. Hmm. Or what I'd like to do is go golfing. No, I don't golf, but I know a guy who does. An excellent golfer, the ever handsome Kevin Hansen. We saved him for last, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna have some. We're gonna have some jamming here. What are we? What are we playing this song for? We're playing this song for. Mike Lemkul and Heidi Frist out there in Annapolis, Maryland. We rock the hell out of this song, don't we, Kevin? Ah. Rolling down High Low Drive, pedal to the metal in my old car. Rolling down High Low Drive. Looking for wherever the good times are. Tank full, top down, and glad to be alive. I can't stop now. Rolling down high, low, drive. Rolling down high, low, drive. Deep in the belly of a Saturday night. Rolling down high, low, drive. Heading toward the bright city lights of Muskego. All you husbands, hide your wives. 
Tonight I'm buzzing up and down high low so good to be alive on high low drive rolling down high low drive dressed to the nines in my sunday suit rolling down high low drive looking for some drugs and a prostitute oh Just kidding you, I'm not that kind of guy. All I want to do is roll up and down high low drive. Ready? High low. High low. High low. Drive. It feels so good to be alive. so good to be alive on high low drive with my clam kill and hardy frisk on high low drive near where kevin used to live on high low drive Kevin, are you feeling in a religious mood tonight? It is Easter Sunday coming up. We're playing tonight is Good Friday. Did anybody watch the show tonight? Anybody watch the show? Another over 300. All right. Okay, I'm sure that all of you are going to be attending your church of choice this week, wearing a Let's Have a Nude Party t-shirt maybe. But especially Tap Dancing Kelly. I know how religious Tap Dancing Kelly is. And I know that Vicki McBride, Vicki McBride, you requested this song. Frank Gassich. Frank Gassich requested this song. Let's celebrate the holiday, shall we? And let's sing. He's dressed in white. He's always clean. He's my main man from the Nazarene. That's Jesus. Jesus Christ. He's making a list. And he's checking it. Let's let's bring out one of the most fabulous actors in the Milwaukee area to portray tap dancing Kelly tonight. He will not be doing any tap dancing, basically be because well he's got bad knees. But Brian Murphy is tap dancing Kelly, who will be singing the background vocals. It's a simple part; everyone will do it. Oh my God, who who let her in? You're vaccinated, right? Thumbs up. Don't let Jesus break your dishes. Keep it on those loaves and fishes. That's Jesus. Everybody. Jesus Christ. Woo! He's going to find out who's naughty and not. Jesus drinks until he's unconscious. Look out, Jesus. Here comes Pontius Jesus. Jesus Christ. His favorite song is Foreigners Cold as Ice. No. His favorite song is I want to lick, 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 lick you from your head to your toes. And I want to move from the bed down. No. His favorite song is More Than a Feeling. Remember that night last winter when we went, we learned every Boston song there was. His favorite, Pipe, you got one? His favorite song is. Not working. But I do know that this, I do know this. Noah begat Ham, Ham begat Shem. Who begat my friend from Bethlehem? Oh, Jesus, sing it! Kelly, you're good. I forgot where I am in the song, though. 21. Thank you. 
Kevin. When he wants to pick up chicks, he puts on a little old spice. By men and Joseph said to Mary, say what? That conception was immaculate. Jesus, come on. And he's shot. Okay, Tap Dancing Kelly, played by Murph, wants me to do something. She wants the extras. She wants the extended version. She wants me to do a little song that a guy taught me. He heard, he heard it in a church in Woodstock, Illinois. And he taught this song to me. And if you think my song is sacrilegious, well, this one was sung in a church. Listen. Five foot nine, eyes to shine, born and raised in Palestine. Has anybody seen my Lord? Heals the sick, raises the dead, does neat things with fish and bread. Has anybody seen my Lord? So if you run into a little Jew dressed up in a sheet, he's real weird, he's got a beard, just take a look at his hands and feet. Five foot nine, he's divine, changes water into wine. Has anybody seen my Lord? He's our Messiah. Has anybody seen my Lord? We call him Savior. Has anybody seen my Lord? Not to be outdone, I came up with a little song that goes, There was a guy, the son of God, and Jesus was his name, oh, J-E-S-U-S, 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 Jesus was his name. There was a really handsome guy, and Kevin was his name, oh, K-E-V-I-N, 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 and Kevin was his name, oh. There was an amazing actor portraying Tap Dodge and Kelly, and Brian was his name. Oh, B R I A N, B R I A N, B R I A N, and Brian was his name. Oh. A lot of people don't know that Murph's name is Brian. <laughs> He's the star of Life of Brian, where he played Jesus, oh, oh, oh. Jesus Christ. Woo. He's making a list, and he's checking it twice. Thank you, everybody. What a wonderful Easter show we had. Kevin, you stay here. We're going to try something. This is a hard one. You guys have to be more careful. we got to stop this, this disease so that I can go play and not worry about it. Because some of you are way too complacent. Some of you, like, you think it's over, but it's not. You think it's over and the coast is clear. The pain is magically disappeared. You think it's over, but it's not. I really shouldn't be so shocked. I'm not surprised that you deny it all. Sometimes I wonder why I try it all. You think it's over, but it's not. I can't believe you're so naive. I can't believe that you're so blind. You believe what you believe, and the truth don't change your. You think it's over, but it's not. And we can go back to the way it was. I'm running out of things to say because you think it's over, but it's not. What? Put your fingers in your ears. You wish that I would shut my mouth. Good news, I'm getting out of here before it all goes. You think it's over, but it's not. And you can put a smile back on your face. Don't overestimate the human race. You think it's over, but it's not. How did we ever get to this place? You think it's over, but it's not. Don't overestimate the human race. You think it's over, but it's not. You think it's over, but it's not. You think it's over.
Over, but it's not. Wow. The ever handsome Kevin Hansen. Thank you for watching. Thank you, Kevin, for playing. Thank you, Kimmy, for singing. Thank you, Murph, for portraying. April 9th, I will see you again. And until then, St. Paul in his letter to the Ephesians said, It came to me upon a midnight glare. I finished writing all of my gospel. You're vaccinated. Come on. It's good enough. Now all I seem to want is sex and me. Mark Antony looked down on Caesar's body. He said, friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ear. I did not come here to praise Caesar. Came here for sex and beer, sex and beer, sex and beer. All the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer, sex and beer. All the things we like around here. Washington, he never crossed the Delaware. There was no midnight rival Paul Revere. Ben Franklin never discovered electricity. They were too busy looking for sex and beer. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the things we like around here. God, look who it is. All the way from lacrosse. Brian and Eraser. Oh my God. Everyone's going to be green with jealousy. But all the two other people who watch this show in lacrosse. The four people. Charles Dickens gave us great expectations. Shakespeare gave us Hamlet and King Lear. Dostoevsky gave us crime and punishment. Who the hell is going to give us? Sex and beer, sex and beer, sex and beer are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer, sex and beer are the things we like around here. Now they can't take away our pride and our dignity. They could use up all our blood and sweat and tears. They could take away our names and give us numbers. Yeah, that's a good number. But they will never take away our sex and beer. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. All the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. All the things we like around here. What do we like? We like sex and beer and sex and beer and Brian and Eraser and sex and beer. All right, this show's gone on long enough. See you next week, everybody!